Mm, try to pick it all up and a winner. Mm. Hello guys! Hi. We are at the Celtic Manor. We're having afternoon tea. We're ladies for lunch. Ladies for lunch? It's our treat. You know, boys went to we go to afternoon tea. And if we're doing afternoon tea, we're going to do it in style at the lovely Celtic Manor. Yeah. So I've got my drink. Are we currently waiting for others? Yeah, this is taking a little bit longer. But we're going to go over, because it's one o'clock now, so as soon as their drinks come, we're going to go over to our afternoon tea and take you along with us. So I'm going to sit and enjoy my drink, and I'll see you in a bit. Ladies' drinks arrived. Is it nice? Yeah. yeah. It's definitely got a ting. We've got a ting. Obviously, all virgin. So I got the virgin daiquiri, and you got the virgin pina colada one. Eh? Mm. And this is our afternoon tea that we are having. It's a spring one, wasn't it? It's a spring afternoon tea mm. at the olive tree. What are we having? Welsh rabbit tart, finger sandwiches. What are we having? Ham rocket salad cream, cheddar cheese, sweet pickle and shots, smoked salmon. Lip. And we're good. There's vanilla scones. And tea. Strawberries and cream. So, we just missed it. We've had lovely teas, but which you've got a lovely. I also need the cream. <laughs> we poured it out and didn't realise it's always awfully bitty. <laughs> then we realised it comes with these funky things. So, you know. So I got strawberries and cream. Um, what did you get, Louise? Lemon and ginger. Lemon and ginger. And you got just traditional just tea. Basic black tea. But, oh, oh, what's coming out the end there? <laughs> oh, Lord. Well, so that was entertaining. Celtic man, and we've got to pour our tea back. <laughs> oh, good Lord. Oh, well. Right, we're never blowing Louise again. We'll leave, we'll leave Louise at home. <laughs> ah. So, what do we think so far, ladies? Very nice. Mm, so we've had this curly pastry thing, that was nice. Yeah, I'm not quite sure that was. So, I think that was the red pepper, walnut and goat's cheese palmier. Mm, that was nice. And then we have the sticky shallot bacon and Welsh rabbit tart. Now that was nice, that was like a quiche wasn't it? And it was warm and soft, it was nice. The sandwiches, I've had the ham and the coronation chicken. But I was just saying, it's a selection of breads, you know, brine bread, white bread. So sandwiches, we had ham, rocket and salad cream. That was nice, yeah. Cheddar cheese, sweet pickle and shallots. Mm. Smoked salmon and cream cheese. You've had that one, haven't you? That's right, just had. Yeah, that's lovely. And coronation chicken. Mm. Yeah, that's nice. And then for cakes and pastries, we have chocolate and hazelnut cheese. Which I'm guessing might be maybe that. That one there. Um, mango and passion fruit shuban. Ooh. Yeah, I think it's that. And then lemon and meringue cheesecake. Cheesecake. And then we also have big scones, vanilla scones, and a fruit scone, served with jam and clotted cream. Mm mm mm. Nice. So we've nearly finished the sandwiches. Amanda's enjoying hers. What did you think of your sandwiches? Absolutely. I think we've decided we're leaving Louise home. <laughs> she comes out in fits of laughter, of laughter for absolutely no reason whatsoever. But no, hey home. <laughs> what did you think of your sandwiches? I thought they were delicious. They were delicious, weren't they? Did you enjoy your sandwiches? Mm -hmm. On to the cakes next. So you can look, I will taste, and I'll tell you all about it later. The tea. On to the tea. How's your tea? It's really good, but bitty. It's bitty. <laughs> How's your lovely normal tea? Lovely. Lovely. I'm, I'm drinking mine because I'm paying enough. But it, uh, Sam, you'd enjoy this, but um, me, it's not my cup of tea. No. Mm. Anyway. Yeah. So, what was the. Um, we got a little menu thing there. Yep. Menu thing? <laughs> Cakes. Mm -mm. English mandolin. 
maybe? I think, yeah. It's, it's like a sponge cake. Can't you? Yeah, so we, we're going to go with that one being the brownie. Mango and passion fruit. So yeah, this must be... I can't see it very well, I'm afraid. We've sat by the window. It's a bit bright. It's a bit windy out there, actually. I'm only cutting that, I was wanting to see the inside. Hello. Have a good taste. Mmm. It's nice though. That's definitely a brownie. Maybe, maybe I'll make it back here. Mm. Mm. So chocolate, mm. chocolate ginger. Mm. What do you guys got? Mm. That was nice. Mm. Let's have a look. Mm. Trying to pick it all up. I'm a winner. Mm. 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 So graceful. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Mm. Get in there and just stick it all in. <laughs> Fork. Ladies who lunch. I only picked it up with a fork because I said it would be breaking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if, um, if you can pick a cheesecake up and it stays together, it's not very good. You get no, too much of something. Yeah. You want it to fall apart. Now that was lovely. So how is cheesecake going? I could eat that again. Tap. Amanda forgot that we need to stew our tea. Oh yeah, yeah, you definitely So she's fishing. Look inside. I'm just opening your mug a second. Look, there's all bits in there. There's something in modern technology. It's called a tea bag. I know, right? Oh, well, darling, yes, that's very true. It's very true, darling. But yeah, I think we should try many places for afternoon tea. So does anybody have any recommendations of where we should try next for an afternoon tea? Um, afternoon? Yeah. Well, I know they do, like, different places do different themes as well, don't they? Um, like, I've had an afternoon tea at um, Christmas time and it was lovely. It was, you know, like things in blankets and stuff like that, you know, like you would at Christmas, um, which is really nice. Yeah. But yeah, I think we should try and make this a regular thing, like not weekly, can't afford that. This is, like this is, too. yeah, every couple of months, I think that would be nice. And it'd be nice for us to get together and do something anyway, wouldn't it? Because the Celtic Manor is £30 a head, but you, the food is lovely so far, but it is just the name you're paying for. It is the Celtic Manor, so it's nice to be up here. It's nice and close. But, um... Still fishing. <laughs> fishing out her tea leaves. Did you remember to stew yours? To use a sieve? It's very pink. At least I could fish mine out. I'm kind of getting used to it. But I still wish I'd have had normal tea. <laughs> Chocolate, hazelnut and ginger brownie. What do you mean? You've got to fit them in. <laughs> she used to fit them in? I'll cut off my feet. And me. I'll cut off my feet and eat those scones. I can tell you right now. Anyway, back to the brownie. Let's cut this in half, shall we? I've said goodbye to anybody last this week. Oh yeah, I stopped dieting this week. I didn't, I don't think so. That's lovely. I know, I don't eat the The only disappointing thing is that it's not gooey in the middle, but you can taste those hazelnuts in there. It gives a lovely crunch. <laughs> mm. Mm. She's at it again. She's knocked her fork on the floor. 
She also just said she's struggling. She doesn't know how she's going to fit in a scone. She has two scones now. She will eat them. We're going to ask for more cream because I could eat that whole pot on my own and I'm pretty sure Amanda could as well. Mm. Million dollar question. Cream or jam first, Louise? Good girl. Have a cream first, I think. I'm not a huge lover of bits in it. Mm. So I would like a little bit. Yeah, I like to just put it on top. Yeah. I don't like to smother it. I like to have it. No. But I like the cream. It's a barrier then of the jam. Craig says the jam makes a barrier, but it's thick clotted cream. It's not. He's a jam first. We have spoken. Ladies who lunch have spoken. Faye, it's cream then jam. So. So how is it? Mm. And she says she only has a little bit of jam. She really does only have a tiny bit of jam. Is it the vanilla scone you've got? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Really and you're going to make yours like a sandwich? Yeah. But have you noticed the cream is on the bottom? Cream first. Just, just saying. Mm. Mm. It's certainly not a shop bought scone, I know that much. No. Mm. It's like really flaky in it. I think the jam is homemade as well. Mm. Like it didn't even have a lot of cream on it. Though. I think it's still warm. I think it's warm. Could be because it's in the sun, but it's warm. It's fresh, I know that much. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy my scones. Hello! Ah, so we're all back. Very, um, very full. Very full. Louise is about to pop. <laughs> <laughs> like, literally, she's walking around and she's having a baby. Um, it was lovely. It was. It was, it was very, lovely. Very nice. Wouldn't necessarily go back again to the Celtic Manor if I'm if I'm honest. The food was lovely. The, the staff were lovely. Were brilliant. They were lovely. Um, but like I said, thirty pound a head. We've just spent ninety pound, which it was nice. The food was lovely. But we're gonna try other places. I think. Yeah, there's cheaper places. Cheaper out places, there. and the food will be just as nice. But at least we can see we've done the Celtic Manor. So, you know, we are start at the top, work your way work down. Work our way down. So, like I said, any recommendations? Put them in the comments. Um, you know, jump in on the lives and let us know. So, because we're gonna we're gonna try another one now in a couple of months. I think. Yeah. So. So basically, whenever the boys decide they want to swan off somewhere, this is what we get. This to is do. what we get to do. So, and that, and it's been nice, isn't it? It's been nice. You know, it has been fruity Louise. You just laughs over absolutely anything. But hey, we wouldn't <laughs> have it any other way. At <laughs> least now we tea. know how to drink our tea <laughs> properly. Um, I don't think we're gonna have that problem anywhere else. No, <laughs> I, I think everybody else has tea bags, <laughs> and we won't go for fruity tea. I just no. think I'll, I'll stick with coffee. I'm... Stick with your black tea and add milk and sugar. Yeah, I'll stick with coffee. <laughs> I always drink coffee, so I went for something else. I don't know, but um, yeah, oh, it started to rain. We're off. Mm. I'm gonna drop off Amanda and Louise now, and then I'm off home. But that's the end of it, really. So we will see you on the next time. Does anybody want to do the thing? No, night? I get told off when mm. I do it. I feel like I'm about to go into a food coma. We should well, run and get in a food coma. <laughs> 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 see you next time. Bye. 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 <laughs>